Good morning students. So this video is for the students of class 7th subject English poem 1 the squirrel. So the poem is the squirrel. The squirrel is a very interesting poem. Before going into the poem let's discuss about squirrel. You must have seen squirrels running around here and there all over the trees. So, squirrel is a rodent. It is a rodent. It is a very interesting and playful animal. It is very naughty and you must have seen it many a times and tried to play with it. So, similar as the poet. In this poem, the poet also tries to play with it and gives description of just such a squirrel. So, this is a poem written by Mildred Bose Armstrong. So the poem is, He wore a question mark for tail, an overcoat of grey, he sat up straight to eat a nut, he liked to tease and play. And if we ran around his tree, he went the other way. Now, the poem starts with the line, He wore a question mark for tail. It means that the squirrel's tail is shaped like a question mark. An overcoat of grey. Overcoat means a long thick coat that you wear in cold weather it means that its fur it means squirrel's fur is gray in color and the poet thinks that it is wearing an overcoat now he sat up straight to eat a nut when the squirrel is running here and there then all the time its body is bent but when it is eating a nut it sits up straight he liked to tease and play tease means generally it means to annoy in a playful manner here tease means that at time the squirrel came near the poet as if it was going to approach him but then it did not actually come near the poet. And if we ran around his tree, this line tells us that the poet and the other children with him, if they ran around his tree, whose tree? Squirrel's tree. To go near, to approach the squirrel, then the squirrel went the other way. It ran in different directions when it was approached by the poet. So, in this poem, we summarize that the poet has described a squirrel with whom he is trying to play, but it ran away in opposite direction. So, he says that its tail, it means the squirrel's tail looks like a punctuation mark that is a question mark. He also describes its fur as an overcoat and says that when it eats a nut, it sits up straight. Now, your homework is you have to read the poem and on the basis of understanding you have to try question answers of poem number one in your rough notebook